Strong public support for Patrick Ku Ken Wee, the victim allegedly roughed up by Petaling Jaya City Council officers, was seen today at the Petaling Jaya Magistrate Court as the senior citizen arrived around 8.50am this morning. Members of the community were seen gathered in solidarity to rally behind the 69-year-old. Uh, I am a community member of the Petaling Jaya. You can speak loud, it's fine. I, like many other community members in residential areas, are a little disturbed by what has been happening. It's human, although on a higher conscious level, uh, we know that what has been done is done. The more important questions I think we should be asking is what will be done next? And some of these may perhaps um, be a very inclusive program that addresses all levels of the very inclusive program that includes all members of the community from the authorities to residentials to activists to just simple job and cat owners. Um, it is a very uh, complex situation actually if you look at it overall but with everyone's participation and addressed at every singular level we can then collectively come together as one human race because we're all actually essentially looking for the same needs, the same requirements, the same place of empathy, and the need for love and affection. Mm. It's just that the way we demonstrate it is different. Mm. So the authorities in this case, um, they think that they're doing their job, their job and uh, being accountable for what they're doing. Uh, at the same time, perhaps a higher conscious level of addressing it with love and empathy with a lot of compassion and some education and training to cultivate a culture of the human race. They can then do their job as well, but without having to inflict um, pain on community members. I think this is a this is a whole big issue that comes from top down, honestly. Um, the dog catchers, I know they're very motivated by uh, financial incentive. Per dog they catch, from what I've heard, is how they're paid. So they're highly incentivized to pick up dogs for that purpose and sort of in any way necessary, right, just to make their income. It's totally unnecessary, it's very cruel, and it actually does nothing to help the stray population to reduce it. In countries such as the Netherlands, they've eliminated the stray problem without using this sort of draconian methods, you know, we should be looking at systems that do work and do reduce harm towards animals rather than the route that we're taking out because clearly it's not working. People are, dogs are getting hurt, cats are getting hurt, and also now people are getting hurt, yeah. Yes, these were all the animals and also what has happened is this wrong, wrong. There's no right to it, there's, there's no trying to prove that justice has been done, um, it's just plain wrong and it's human I don't know how else can one make this to be, to make logic out of what has happened here.